Welcome back. Well, no matter if you're planning on planing, sanding, or sawing, look no further than exact. I'm here with Andrew Bernard. And Andrew, I tell you what, great pleasure to have you on the show. We're so impressed with your products here. They really do it all, and they do it accurately, save a lot of time, and that's why we're here. Tell us a little bit about your product. Well, what we've got here, we've got a whole a range of products in from the United Kingdom, which are hugely popular. And I'm going to show you some, some demonstrations in a minute, which are going to blow your mind. They cut faster, they cut neater, and more importantly, they're cut safer. Of these products, you know, we've sold over one million of these in Europe. Okay, of that one million, 30% are female that buy this product. And you're going to see why when I begin, because there's everything you want to do in your home, we can do it right here, right now, and give you a homeowner's uh, owner's makeover so quickly, so easily. So you'll watch these now and you'll see just what I'm talking about. Well, I'm excited about that. What do we have right here? Now, this is the exact saw. This machine. It's a UK invention, UK company. It will cut down and through any material you can think of except for glass down to a depth of half inch. Steel, aluminum, brass, copper, hardboard, chipboard, plasterboard, any material you can see on this bench. Up to, up to half inch. Down to half inch, any material. It's done with different blades. I'll show you how you change those in a minute. But Every machine comes with a two-year manufacturer warranty, a 30-day money-back guarantee, but more importantly, it comes with this black hose. This will connect to any shop or domestic vacuum cleaner. Now we can work dust-free, so we can remove the grout between your tiles. Dust-free, dust correct. You can, as I've done with this one here, you can remove plunge cut and remove these corners without even taking a tile off the floor or the wall and recreate a new look. So that's the blade we're going to be using now, this one here, and that should do you somewhere in the region of around about one to two bathrooms of soft wall tiling. The minute you get into this stuff, you're going to shorten the life of that blade a little bit. Now, so we've sold over one million of these machines in Europe. One million. One million. Of that one million, 30% are female that have bought this machine. 30% are ladies that have bought this machine. But it's easy, it's they lightweight. Handle it, so they're gonna handle it. Absolutely. Now here's one for you to look at. The worst cut or the tard, tard, hard cut to do is one that you take a fine amount off the edge of this tile. Watch what I do with this. So now what we've done with now, the alternative to that is a wet cut, outside, wind, rain. We've got no dust, we can work on in the property at the place. Now, the next one, what happens if you have an electrical power box that comes partially or fully into a tile? How do you get over that? Okay. Wet cut, you have to drill, 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 drill. Maybe you have to put it on a wet... Very, very, very clumsy process. Oh, exactly. Now I'm just going to quickly cut it. I'm not going to mark it out, so you'll see. Just watch this. So now we've cut through the tile. Now, it's not all about straight lines. Watch this, sir, because we can as well. Now we've done a curve. So we've not only have we now remodeled our bathroom, we've now Take, Good morning. We've now we've now taken out the old grout. We've now created a new look. We've now worked into into different tiling, including remember porcelain. We can do any form of tiling you like. That is the first blade. Next up is this blade here. Now this blade obviously is for all your wood, all your plasterboard, all your dry lining, or all, all your all your woody type stuff that you can do. To change the blade, I'm going to change machines. You would change blades. To change the blade is very, very simple. All you do is slide this out. You get two keys in the kit. One will lock the motor on the back. The other, in the direction of the arrow, you undo that. The blade will drop out the bottom. You'll put your new blade in and then you'll redo that up and lock it back into place. The record's about 25 seconds, so it doesn't take very long to do it now. Next up, 
you ever cut wooden flooring? Do you? Do you look? Sometimes. And of course, a lot of people also cut this stuff. This stuff here is not easy to cut because it's dusty, it's messy, it causes no end of problems. But what we're going to do is just show you how quickly you can cut through this stuff. And look at the finish on that. No dust, no mess, simple. It is an amazing tool. This is why it's so popular. I'll just show you how quick you can be. So now, next one to show you is laminate flooring. How do we cut laminate flooring? How do you guys cut laminate flooring at the minute? How do you cut your laminate flooring, anybody? How do you cut your laminate flooring, sir? Circular saw, jigsaw. Jigsaw, okay. So with, a, with laminate flooring, most people get up, they have a bench, they cut, or they work on a bench like that, or they go outside and have a machine. This machine here really is the only way to cut laminate flooring because you don't have to, again, leave the work area. It will cut it beautifully for you. Now, what you have is a pointer, top and bottom. Those two pointers show you the direction you're going to go and where the blade is. So if you have a pencil line, because you're cutting around uh, maybe a bath or some, something you need to cut around, yeah. you can follow it. So now we can cut a shape. So now, to get the perfect cutout in a tile, very, very easy. The machine is totally safe. When I switch it on, nothing's going to happen. But the only way the, bla the blade will come out is when I release this by pushing it down. So that's how you get your plunge cut. Look, nothing's going to happen. Push that. So it's very, very safe and easy to use. So now you've got numbers that all work the same. So what you do, you set this to the depth of the material you're going to cut. In this particular case, 3 eighths of an inch or 7 mil because it's in metric. So I know that when I do plunge down, the blade will come out on the same number I've set it to there. They all will be the same. So it will come out on the 7 mil, go in the 7 mil and come back. So for me to do the perfect cutout, all I need to do you start my cut there on the 7mm or the 3.8, plunge in, finish on the 3.8 on the front, 7mm. So that is how you get the perfect cutout. Let me show you that so you can see exactly what I'm doing. I'll do it at an angle where you can see it. So we're going to start here. That's how you get the perfect cutout in any material. Now, I know what you're thinking, wow, I'm loving this machine, it can't get any better, but just keep bearing in the back of your mind, if you like what you've seen with this, this is its bigger brother. This will cut down to one inch. Same rules apply, exactly what you've seen with the baby one there, down to one inch in depth. So all your three quarter, all your big concrete blocks, all the bigger things you want to do with all the different blades. The only thing this won't cut is steel and glass at the minute. We're on a blade on that. So now, Let's just move on to the last thing to show you. This, of course, is our steel cutting blade. The steel cutting blade, as you can see, cuts steel. And that is pretty impressive. Carbide, again, is a slightly different blade, but it's in the angle of the blade that gives you the finish you're looking for. So, cutting steel. If anybody here cuts steel, anybody? Few of you. So, I'm just going to, again, change machine. I'm not going to change blade. Same blade, you can see it in there now. I've set the depth of cut to the thickness of the material. Now, we're going to cut through this and you'll see. Watch as it plunge through. You should see the blade through there if you get close enough. I mean, that is amazing. No heat and it's ready to go. So now we've cut tiling. We've done, we've done all our wood, all our tiling. We've done our dirty old grout removal. We've cut steel. In actual fact, we've cut everything. This machine will do it all for you. But there's just one more little added bonus that you're going to love. We can actual fact pop this on to the top of that. Now, feast your eyes on what you can do with this because now you can cut your copper pipe. You can cut all your bigger pipe right up to four inch pipe. 
So now we have a machine that is able to do everything you need it to do in your home. Any job, nothing is too big or too small for this job. It is a one-stop machine. Remember, if you love what you're seeing so far, newexactsaw.com. Get on the internet, check them out, and they will give you their nearest dealer to get your very own exact saw. But let's move on, because we've got lots more to show you. We've already covered the little one. We've covered its bigger brother. But just feast your eyes on this. This is the world's first sander planer. So it is a conventional plane in every aspect of the word. You can plane with it, rebate with it, clean up old lumber with it, make the lumber look like new, but it has some fundamental changes that you won't believe. Number one, the machine is cast in one solid block, not two pieces put together. Number two, you can adjust it in 30 second increments which you'll see why in a second. So we've got lots of adjustment. Number three, it is the only machine in the world to have its own inbuilt vacuum cleaner. It physically has a vacuum cleaner that sucks the dirt, the debris, the dust, the shavings away from the work area. Now, it will fire it into the bag provided, but it is very, very efficient, this machine, so I can pretty much guarantee that you will fill this bag up pretty, pretty quick. So. But the biggest and the main reason why this is so, so special, because in less than 30 seconds, I can take this out and drop this in. Now, as a drum sander, which I might add is four times more efficient than any belt, 40 times more efficient than any orbital sander, we can sand just the lacquer off a damaged table, worktop dining table, kitchen table, maybe the, the, the entrance floor. I can take just the, the lacquer, the paint off fiberglass. I can do uh, for mica tops if you want to, the edging on that. We can do just about anything. I'm going to show you some samples of that. First up, thought what we'd get is a bit of flooring. Now, if you look at this flooring, we're going to scratch it up. Now with this flooring, which is scratched, what you've got to remember, I've only got a finite amount of veneer on there, so I can't afford to go too deep. Now I'm going to connect this up to our vacuum cleaner so that we're not using the bag. Now I'm going to turn this around, and if you want, I'm going to set this on around about a 30 second. We're using the drum. So now I'm going to sand just a foot, small amount of this. Now if you look there, all I've done is taken just the lacquer off that, nothing more. What do you think on that finish, sir? It's amazing. Brilliant. So now we've cleaned up. Now to be fair, I could have gone a little bit deeper. The point is, I'm controlling the depth, it's not going to tell me how deep I'm going to go down. Now just to show you a bit more, the beauty about this machine, you can sand in any direction. This is a bit of laminate, I'm now going to take the lamb out of the laminate. So I'm going to set it a little bit deeper. Now as a machine, you can see I've taken off probably the sixteenth of an inch off the edge of that. That could have been several layers of paint, it could have been fiberglass, composite. I can even sand steel with this machine. So, so far, we have covered just about most things you want to do in your home. But one thing you've noticed, I've kept talking about it all connects, all no dust, no mess, that it all comes back into a vacuum cleaner. Feast your eyes on this because what I've got here, not only, what a range of tools we're offering you. What you've got here is our little mini vacuum cleaner. Now, this is no ordinary vacuum cleaner. This little baby is a little bit different. It comes with a load of ordinary typical attachments you'd expect to see with any normal vacuum cleaner. So if you look on the top we've got two buttons. One, we push it to number two and that is our normal vacuum cleaner. We can vac the stairs, the office, the home. But when we look inside, two major things. Number one, it's bagless. Number two, yes, you're right folks, it's HEPA filter. This has a HEPA filter, meaning it's going to get all those fine particles of dirt and dust out, and we have a washable sock on the outside. Everything you need, and this machine is under 90 bucks, so you're looking at a very affordable machine. All the attachments, but just to finish off, what we do have, of course, is this. 
What is that? That is known as an auto start. So what does it do for you? It means when you plug your machine in and you're ready to go, the machine goes for you. It is that way it works. So when you work, it works. When you stop, it stops. So making your life easier, it collects your dust, your mess. Every machine I've shown you here now works dust free. That means you haven't got to go outside, you haven't got to sheet up, it's going to save you time, it's going to save you money. That is the range from the new exact saw. Well, Andrew, with that said, right now, I know you have to have the attention of all of our viewers out there. What's so. the best way for them to learn more about all of Exact products? Well, you've got two options. You can jump on the internet, which is the best way, and go to newexactsaw.com. Check out their website, and that will lead you to the nearest dealer near them where they can pick up any one of these machines for themselves. Easy enough. Well, Andrew, thank you so much no, for being on. Pleasure.